Hi everyone, it's Farmer Darrell and I'm down in Farrowing House number two and that's because we've had a, a brand new fantastic litter born here with our pigs. I have quite a bit to do with the pigs and it's always pleasing when one of the sows raises such a good litter like this. She's actually had 19. Now that's a little bit heavy, average litter size is about 15 to 16 at the moment which is still good. Uh, the sow normally is around 14 teeth so it can cause few complications. However, she's doing a sterling job, she's a keen mum uh, and all the little piglets uh, have got a good coloration as well. They're all equal size as well. Uh, there's no really big ones, no really small ones. So it's a really good litter. She's a fairly new mum as well. I think this could be a second uh, litter, maybe a third at, at, at most. And she's doing really well. She's a little bit loud, but that's just letting us lot know not to come too close because she's doing a good job as a mum. Um, when you see the piglets, you're going to see that the good coloration, that means the Hampshire ball, the dad, uh, he's a black pig, uh, mum is a white pig, a land race large white and there's a good mix of coloration amongst them so they look striking uh, and are very pleasing on the eye. I think, I think what we do now we monitor what the adult pig gets fed as well because when she's just littered she's not necessarily going to be starving hungry so we build the feed up over a period of time but as these piglets get older and moving on towards four, five, six weeks old we're going to have to put the female's food up accordingly to make sure she's making good quality milk to keep all those little mounds well fed. And yet the, the day after uh, this uh, this really big litter, um, we, had a, we had the second litter, uh, not as big, but bigger piglets. So because the sow uh, has had a dozen rather than 19, all these little piglets look older uh, than them next door because they're less piglets, but they're bigger. And again, they're a good even size, no runs, um, and she's doing a really good job. She's letting them feed right now uh, as we speak. So that's a manageable litter for her. If the girl next door starts to struggle a little bit and those piglets are taking it out a little bit, apart from increasing the fees, we could always adopt a couple over onto this litter because it's a smaller litter, we rub a bit of her scent on, when she can sleep like that, other mom, not the 11 out. So we've got some, uh, we've got two cracking litters, slightly different, slightly different coloration, slightly different size and numbers, but both homes doing really well. Are doing a good job so we've had a good outcome there everything's looking really good and we're getting ready uh, for the next one the young lady next door is going to be the one around the 8th of November um, so hopefully she's going to do as good a job as uh, the two cells we've just been talking about and she's going to have as good a litter and by the looks of it she's dead keen so thanks for listening like and share it farmer Darrell, farrowing house too canon old farm